When Hurricane Katrina struck, Detroit's Steve Adams volunteered to help. He'd never done it before, but since then, this construction specialist has raced off to Haiti, Joplin, and other disaster sites. Have any of your friends from the construction world look at you and say, hey, you're supposed to be out here like building things. What are you all of a sudden trying to save the world for? It's addictive to help people. I think it's what makes our country great. I think it makes people come alive. Where do you want to be? Adams now uses equipment and knowledge from his construction life to create things like a solar-powered water filtration system. So these units harness the sun's energy yep. and then help make clean water where there isn't. Did you ever think when you got out of uh, school or were in construction that you'd be finding ways to give pure water to no. places around the world? Yeah. We used to build hot rods and race them, and the trailers used You're to like everybody else in Detroit. <laughs> Where most of us watch, Steve Adams jumps in, including here in Motown. And there's so many homes um, that people are walking away from. A lot of people will call us and say, you know, all the furniture, will you come and get it? So we're able to provide, take furniture from houses that have been sort of abandoned, hang on to it, and then mm -hmm. help furnish places mm -hmm. for people who are mm -hmm. moving in or getting started again. Absolutely. Pretty simple idea. I am here. My next step will be doing this all the time. Steve Adams saw trouble and took a leap. And with each new rush to the rescue, he carries with him the heart of Detroit.